Hello there, I am Giant Girl with more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team. In the last part we took on the um, town square, we did two new rescue missions, and now we're gonna progress on the story. Yeah, but we went to Pokemon Square by the way. Yes, here's that dream of myself again. Again? Am I dreaming again? Is that- it's that Pokemon again, huh? They're just- they're- they are... Talking to me? I can't hear anything. I can't hear them clearly. What am I... What are they saying? Huh? It's shaking. An earthquake? Whoa! It's getting worse. For a dream, this feels strangely real, but... That's odd. The next morning. Um, hello. Uh, oh, hello. <laughs> Who said that? Huh. Hello, uh, you are Steven, aren't you? Yeah, but, uh... Oh, you can't see us, of course. How rude, how very rude of us. Oh man, you made a big hole in my bedroom or something, you know? We're pleased to meet you, we are Doug Trio. Last night, during the earthquake, our child Digger was attacked. He was whisked, whisked away to the peak of a tall mountain. We couldn't possibly climb somewhere so high up. That is why we must call upon you for your help, Steven. Diglett was abducted by a Pokemon named Skarmory. Named Skarmory. It's a... It's a vilely vicious ruffian. Please do not... Please do be careful. Please, we need your help. We must go. Okay. Looks like we got ourselves a rescue mission. That was so sudden, there was no time to even say no. It's too bad, I better go. Or say hi. It was either no or hi, that last word. Yeah. Where's Cody? Good morning, Steven. Huh? You were just asked to go on another rescue mission? Yes. Is that Doug Trio again? Our, chick our, our child Diglett was kidnapped. He was taken to Mount Steel's summit. Please, we need your help. Bye bye. Okay, okay, let's go. So if you go right down to your rescue mission or rescue, from your rescue base, you'll see Mount Steel. But I want to do some preparing first. First of all, um, team, uh, give, I want to give me an Oinberry, of course. The Petra was for the bucks. Give, I'm going to give Cody an Oinberry. Boynberry. Okay, um... Be here, bye. I don't really need anything, I don't think. Let's check what's on the TM side, though. The TM, it's an orbs. Attract and skip. Okay, cool. So, yeah, we gotta store some items first. Store. Let's see here, I didn't go. This time we'll keep... Keep a couple apples. Uh, we should be good. I want to try to equip the Dove Rock, so... Oh, wait, no, hold on. I'll do that outside there. Okay, so... Items, grab rocks. Go. Didn't mean to put that in alphabetical order. Shoot. Okay, whatever. Okay, now we can go to the Gulp and Link shop, and I want to link, um, moves with, um... I want to link tackle and tear up, I think. Yeah. Link these two moves. There we go. I can't just put um, pokey, but that's okay. Shall we go on? Nah, I'm good. And... Got to Deposit or store some of our money. Uh, the rest of my money. Okay. Um, other than that, I think we set to go. Yeah. Let's go to Mount Steel. Okay. Mount Steel. Here we are, Mount Steel. So Diglett was whisked to its peak. That's right. 
Yeah, stop popping up like that. The peak is on the ninth floor. Thank you for helping. Farewell. Yeah, that's awkward. Um, let's go. Okay. Now, um, as they just said, Mount Steel is nine fours, so keep that in mind. But we're gonna try to save Diglett. I'm right next to the steps, but I'll take this. Dang it, didn't look out. That six goon is giving me pain. Okay, Cody Gear level nine, nice. Stats went up, awesome. Wait, can I try to change? I want to try to use scrub rocks now. Set. Okay, we press R to throw one. So that's cool, I guess. Okay, let's go to the next floor. Very nice. Oh man. I, don't, I, I meant to take a reviver seed too. Oh man. Okay, hold on. I think Cody just threw a Warnberry at me, so I have to make up for it. Let me see. Warnberry. Give. Cody. Okay. Stephen Groot at level 10, well withdraw, okay. That's cool. I really wanted to come into this um, dungeon at least with one revive see it, but I forgot. So oh man, this is not where the stairs are. I could throw gravel rocks with the R. Oh. Oh well, we'll forget that later, I guess. Okay, let's go to the next floor.
Okay, on the ninth floor. Yeah. We made it to the summit, I guess. Look, Steven, Diglett's over there. And Diglett's way over there. Hey, are you st are you all right? We've come to rescue you. I I'm scared. Oh, it's a Skarmory. You, what do you think you're doing here? We're here to rescue Diglett. Skarmory, don't do this. Release Diglett. How dare you? It's your it's their fault. I haven't slept in days because the earthquakes frightened me so. Every night we had. We had them. Those earthquakes are caused by the, the sprats. Look, running around underground. That's not true. Well, it's true that there have been many earthquakes lately, but it would take more than Diglett's family going wild under the ground to cause earthquakes. You be quiet. We'll fight if you keep this. If you keep that up, it's no good. Sky is too agitated to listen to reason. We have to fight it, all, it out, yeah. And yeah, we have to do that. So this is your first boss in this game. I don't have any more bubbles, which kind of stinks. Uh, let's go to Cody's moves. I only want him to use Ember, because oh, Cody is, if you have a fire type as you yourself or your partner, this boss is like really easy. Um. You try to throw on gravel rock. Oh, I think that that didn't work out great. Okay, whatever. Let's just attack it then. There we go. And that—that's all it took. I'm Steven's grid level 11. I did grid level 11. Nice. Well, that was an easy fight. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for the 490 experience points, Scarmy. Grr, I can't keep up. I'll flee for now. And you can't recruit this Skarmory, so don't even try. We'll get to recruiting later, though. Hello there. Uh, hey there. You, we chased Skarmory off. It's okay now. Come down over here. I can't. I'm too scared to move. Okay, no problem. We come, we'll come to you. Just wait. Whoa. Sheesh. Look at this cliff. I can't see the bottom. Steven, what do we... What will we do? We can't get across this. Bzz, bzz. Oh hi, you're the Magnemite we saved. Yes, word, word got to it. Word got, we got word of this. We can rescue Diglett from the sky. Bzz. Hold on, hold on to, on to us tight. Bzz. Don't be scared. We will make it, the mistake of zapping you. Bzz. So that's awesome. They come and help us. Oh, I was very scared. Maybe because I some was up somewhere up high. Maybe because I was somewhere up so high. My feet felt like they're still walking on air. Feet? Yes, them feet. Well, you're safe now. That's what counts. Yes, thank you very much. Oh, you have been rescued. Great, great. Ah, oh, who's saying that? Is that the duck trio again? Huh? What was that? Am I hearing voices? Whoops, you can't see us. That's terribly rude of us. All shocked. Oh, Duck Trio here. Um, oh, Papa. Diglett, you had us worried. You're not hurt. Nope, it was, I was scary. It was scary, but, I, but I'm alright. It's all thanks to Steven's team. Thank you for everything, you're heroes. You should be thanking our Magnemite friends. This rescue was impossible for us to do on our own. Oh, how rude of us. Thank you so much. No, no. It was only... It was only... It was the only thing to do. And how both... How both our evolved forms were joined trios. I felt a... I felt a certain kinship. After all, all Pokemon must help each other. I'm impressed. Sincerely, thank you. We must be going, Steven. Cody, thank you. Farewell. Okay, bye, Diggle and Duck Trio. Yeah, Steven, if you find your Pokey, the team must reach a Petrol Scarf, which will protect you from uh, poison if it's a hell of an item, I believe, so that's cool. Uh, we got the item uh, Ginseg. I don't even know how to pronounce that. We'll be on our way, too. 
Oh wait, don't go away. What is it? Uh, would you like to join our team? Join your team? Yes, we couldn't have done the last job if you weren't around, Magnemite. I thought we would need more help from for doing rescues in the future. Steven, don't you think so? Yes, more members needed. If you say, well, we don't need any help, we won't progress in the story. So I want to just have them enjoy our team anyway. So how about it? We join us as, as members of our rescue team. Rescue team? That sounds fun. Bzz, bzz, bzz. But if you need us to rush over to rescues, to do rescues, we need somewhere to live close by. Is there anywhere we can live in this area? Mmm, well, I'm well. Oh, there isn't. Too bad. Sorry, but we can't join you. See you. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Oh man, that's a shame. That's, that is too bad. It looks like we need to find places for Pokemon to live if we want some Pokemon, some to join our rescue team. I know. Let's go out to Pokemon Square tomorrow. There's an interesting place called the Wigglytuff Club. It wasn't open the other day when we went to the square. It should be open tomorrow though. It should. It's next to the Velocity Bank. Wigglytuff is usually there every day. We need to be. We need. We may be able to get some information. Okay, that's what we'll do then. We'll th that's what we'll do tomorrow. We we'll go to Pokemon Square. Nice. And with that, this has been the end of my Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Murder Ski Team Walk the Guide part. In the next part, we'll take on and we'll go back to Pokemon Square and do some more rescue missions stuff. And hopefully, get that problem solved where we can hopefully get Magnemite to join our or the Magnemite to join our rescue team. So yeah, this is Majanko again. I would like to thank you again. Goodbye, and hope to see you guys in the next part of my Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team Walkthrough Guide.